Hello, I just wanted to show you my Canon Ring Light BlackBerry battery powered hack. It utilizes a Canon camera, the 3400IS. There's the BlackBerry battery. It's wired up. As you can see a close up there, uh, the outer two contacts are wired up and uh, soldered in a way that the battery can still insert into the BlackBerry phone to charge. On top, uh, the wires line up and go right into the ring light. And that ring light, as you can see there, is hot glued to the front of the camera. Uh, when you don't need it, it's pretty unobtrusive and you can use the camera every normal way possible. So that's why I decided to just hot glue it on so I don't have to worry about it. These are the ring lights. They're very common. You can find them in any place, sometimes even dollar stores. They're very cheap. They hook up into USB and therefore they run on 5 volts. All you have to do is dismantle it and pull out the PCB with the LEDs and you can use it directly without any modification whatsoever. Uh, the BlackBerry battery, as you can see there, uh, beside the BlackBerry phone, if you just slip it in, it will actually charge the battery without you having to unsolder any wires or any connections. So there it is sort of mated together. You can see you can even have your phone on at the same time as the ring light. Uh, they just pull juice from the same battery. So here is a test of the macro features. As you can see, I'm focusing on a penny. If you get too close to the penny, there's a small dark shadow that appears in the middle. That's because the actual lens on the camera starts to uh, interfere with the light. So there's a, a cone where you actually can't get too close, but that's fine because anyway the macro feature on this camera lines up perfectly with where the distance of the LED is. There's a picture of the penny and as you can see you can get a pretty reasonable close-up and uh, depending on the camera you choose some have a little bit better resolution. So there's, there's just a, an example of the close-up that I took not bad for a $100 camera and uh, pretty much a free battery that I had laying around for using with my old phone and the ring light that is just hacked from a, one of those USB uh, ring lights costs a few bucks. Zooming in you can see the kind of detail that you can get here uh, and that's just uh, one example. And the beauty is that it's part of the camera, so you don't have to actually have any attachments. So there's a close-up of the date on the Canadian penny. Quite detailed and very clear. And no need for worrying about any ex external lighting or any other kind of lights whatsoever, because it's part of the camera permanently, and you can always charge it up. These batteries, by the way, I've had uh, the ring light used on batteries such as this for months before I had to charge again. So really, you're talking about using it for months before needing to charge it. And there's uh, just a small, tiny little switch um, plastic that I was using and just another close-up. You can even see uh, on the picture, you can get down to the fibers on the paper. You can see how close you can get. You can even see fibers from that uh, paper that I have the switch sitting on. So there's just uh, the close-up, as you can see. Now I have a few other examples I'll show you at the end of the video of some macro photography that I took with this setup. Uh, but again, it's a very simple hack to put together if you have the parts. In fact, any um, because Blackberries have removable batteries, you can use a number of different phones, all of which you can just hot glue the battery on. They run 3.7 volts, even though the LEDs uh, should take 5 volts. There's no harm running them at 3.7. In fact, running them at 5, I found them to be too bright. So 3.7 is just fine. So here's an example of the micro SD card uh, being taken, a photo taken of it. That's a um, SIM card slot, just a couple of pins on uh, a PCB board again some microchips. Now it's hard to tell the scale. These are extremely tiny but if you're not familiar with with chips it may be hard to tell. So instead I took a picture of my hand and you can see here I'm zooming in on uh, some um, hair follicles on my knuckle. Thank you very much and I hope you enjoyed this uh, Canon 
BlackBerry-powered ring light hack.